Hi you guys, Miss Denise here and I have two very cool surprises for you. So, what I want you to do, I want you to go around your house and I want you to find two toys that look like this. Bet you know what these are. These are balls. That's right. You can go find a small one. You can go find a big one. It doesn't matter. Just go find one and come meet me back in front of the phone, the camera, the computer, wherever you are. All right. So for our video, Miss Denise is going to use this big one because it's her favorite color. Can you guess what color this is? That's right. Purple. And what color is this? Orange, right? Can you tell me or any of the grown-ups around you what color the ball is that you have great job so we're going to take our surprise and put it carefully down on the floor we're going to take our pita pointer fingers and we're going to place them on the side of our surprise and then we're going to lift that surprise up 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 and down 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 again up 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 and down just using one finger on each hand now we're going to put all of our fingers on the ball and we're going to use our fine motor skills to turn that ball around and around kind of like a globe there we go all right now we're going to put our surprise on the floor and we're going to try to roll it all around us we're going to pretend like our body is an island and the ball is a nice ship just rolling around and around and you can wave to the people on the ship and say hello people Good job, All right? There's a lot of fun other things we can do with our surprise. You can take your wrist, which are right here. You can pick up your surprise by your wrist and you can pretend like it's a birdie and you can fly around and around and around. Good job. There's one more animal. There's one more animal. We're gonna pretend our surprise is, all right? We're at this time, we're gonna pick our surprise up by our elbows, all right? And when you flap your hands over, it looks like a bunny rabbit and go hop, 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 hop. There we go. All right. So now we're going to take our surprise in our two hands. We're going to do little catches, just little catches. There we go. Good job. Now we're going to try to see if we can take our surprise and hold it with our knees. We can even pretend like we're making apple juice or orange juice. We can pretend that our surprise is our fruit. So me and that mine is purple, I'm gonna pretend like my surprise is a grape. And I'm going to take my cup, put it underneath, and I'm gonna squeeze my surprise. Oh, mm, some good juice. One more time, let's do a nice squeeze. Equally good. All right, you guys. Now, we're gonna take our surprise and we're gonna hold it with our feet. All right, now we're gonna do some abdominal work, our abdominal or our tummy muscles, and we're gonna lift our toes up, 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 up. There we go, but we wanna make sure you don't put your back on the floor, your back is nice and up, your hands are down. Again, let's lift the ball up, and we'll count to five and say one, two, three, four, five. There we go. We can also do a super fun rock back with our surprise. So still holding it with your feet, you're gonna rock back, and up, and again, back, and up. And do you think you can pass your surprise to your hands as you roll back? Go back, grab, and up. One more time, rock back, and catch, and up. All right, that was super fun. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And you guys can even find some other really cool things to do with your surprise and other neat things around your house and you can share it with your grown-ups you can share it with your brothers and sisters and you can leave a comment and share it with miss denise and let me know what fun things you found to do in your house with your surprise see you guys